What is happening, y'all? Cowboy here. Welcome back. Ready to continue, and I just noticed... Look at this thing. Stranger's face mask. I didn't notice he dropped that, but look at this thing. It has more de defense than the Vulture and the Spark Defender stuff. Spark Defender has higher stability, but... Whew, and it doesn't have a negative uh, damage modifier towards armor, so uh, yeah, solid upgrade there. Uh, so anyway, we're going to focus on... I decided to upgrade the Slash Brand and this guy. So we are going to use those two. Do for those materials. And we're going to go this way. And we're basically going to just jump straight on in. Guys, guys, stop. Listen, this is... doesn't need to be like this. Alright, listen to you. You there, Mr. Shieldy. Actually, hold up. Just before I go, just in case. Yeah. Because, like, we reset things. Oh, not gonna work. So shitty. Anyway, into the new area. Plaza. Here. Just alright. Building stabilizers. Increased defense than stability. Oh shit, that's super good. The extra 200 defense? What's my total defense? Wow, that's a lot. That is a lot. Uh yeah, that is super nice. It essentially doubles my defense while I'm charging an attack to make sure it's going to go off. That's going to be invaluable in, uh, in breaking shields. Okay, so I can take that to get back to there. That's convenient. I can open this door. This guy has a left arm that is about to be mine. the wrong dude. Oh, thank you. Omni cells are always nice. This connects through where exactly? Oh, oh, okay. I know where we're at. Yeah, okay. Uh, 
so that's it for over here. So that's just, uh, I don't have to take the lift approach anymore. Just a uh, faster way to get back. Watch her. She's heading toward the subway tunnels. We'll never find that damn kid if she gets underground. Doesn't matter. The general's got her ID. She's going to Gideon to rock. The mercs at the Babylon Gardens can take over. Babylon Gardens, copy that. All right, Chess, give me something good. What is this? Darkened Dragoon? Oh my god, it's a new spear. Just after... Just after I was all depressed because I thought I was never going to get a good spear. Got a new spear. So, damage is less. But better impact. Better energy gain. And it has nano damage on it. And this is only MK2. So, uh, yeah, that's going to get upgraded for sure and become the main weapon. For now, I'm going to use this. So, I unlock that later, more than likely. Capital Square. Hunters have arrived at the Cloud Nine Bar. No incidents to report. Over. Copy that. They found a way around the scanner gate. Looking into it now. Over and out. City is complete. The evacuation of Jericho City is complete. Yo, that guy over there looked beefy, man. that up. Oh, where is that big old beautiful thing I got? So, comparatively, less damage than my four sets. But, that's still pretty good at 118. 128 on that. Damn, you're 131? It's a lot less damage. So, the other spear has more damage and more attack speed. Shit. Let me use it for a little bit, see if the nano damage can make up for the difference. Underground. Is this a backdoor entrance to the underground? Wonder. Because there was quite a bit in the underground that I couldn't access. So if stuff here is... I'll figure out where I should go based on levels. Increase energy gain, but decrease defense. Not a fan, and so lift. Alright, well, that's a nice short adventure. Can't be 
doing anything without the lifter hook. I'm surprised I don't have one of those yet. So I think that level relates to the, the MK tier of the gear stuff is using. So my fa face mask is at five. Everything else, for the most part, is like a three or a two. All right, so yeah, all right. I'm supposed to not go that way, but go this way. Uh, that is a nice. Nice beefy looking enforced crusher. Does that differ from the other thing I had? Salvaged crusher. So it's a salvage crusher that's been reinforced. It's got some good damage on it. chest through halfway through there. Hold up a second. Oh, it's a gate. Okay. I saw the treasure. I got distracted. I don't see the gate for farther back. This new spear certainly seems like it would get the job done though. Weapons are good, but like honestly, I feel like I there's a good chance of me just killing something. The one problem with it is quite a few people now. I've uh, basically the nano explosion goes off. Before I get a chance to get the gear that I want off of them. Data was really good, I think, in the original surge, if I remember correctly. Let's go check over here. I think this. Damn it! Well, he was a bit lower. Now that guy's got a fun-looking weapon. This, I think, this leads me 
all the way back to the original. Yeah, it does. Because there's the one that goes up to uh, Spearbro that I missed out on. Right. You have a very neat looking weapon. Oh shit, there's another one. Oh, guys, guys, guys. So cute and sing like a bunch of dancers. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for talking shit. Oh god, they're they're shocking me. That's why I can't dodge. Never take me alive. Uh, fifteen percent energy gain. Damn, that's also a nice, nice passive pickup. Let's see if I can lure him into this little alley. I need one of you to de-aggro. Urban arm gear. You'll see content active. Uh, it's an urban head that you have. Oh no, I have a good head, so let me focus on getting his uh, chest. Bro. Wait, did I not get the schematic for the weapon? Increase damage while three or more batteries are filled and increase damage more while five or more are filled. Increase defense. Arm piece of an MG Cerberus gear set powerfully reinforced with back alley machinery. Interesting. Liquidator elemental defense is plus 200 to reduce damage taken from poison and nano. Um, okay, I did get it. Been judgment axe. Now that thing looks badass. Which somehow still has less damage than what I was using. But giant electro axe looks cool. guy. I really like the heavy counterattack. Oh, fuck. That hurts. giant electro axe for a bit I mean compared to this I think I would take this guy because it's just more damage more impact more attack speed somehow better energy gain um, so for slower guys use this for heavier guys use that and then the schematics uh, inventory schematics so I need to get legs in a head well, legs actually, because I can the head I have I can use for anything, which is super super convenient. That's probably the best thing about this is it has the uh, you know counts towards all of their set bonuses. So 45 defense on a headpiece, and it counts towards everything. 
which when you think about it is phenomenal because to try and get sets like those guys, as long as I can get, um, you know, uh, just a leg and an arm, I could go after a three-piece bonus. Or a leg, arm, chest, then I can make six-piece bonus. Um, what are you using? What kind of gear is that? It's like scrub gear. So the ability to cut is it's based on a health threshold, but you have to have damaged that part to a certain extent. Uh, how did you find me? No, impossible. It was right there. I mean I barely damaged his armor, but st still enough that I could cut it off. Hell oh, yeah. Yeah, my Omni cells. Sorry, sniper. Looks like you're out of business. Do I have that yet? I don't think I do. I'm gonna get some, big guy. Ooh, that's that other set. Uh. Oh. I didn't get a piece from that last one, I thought. All right, so we'll take your weapon and your arm. Let's go. Damn, heavy weapons are dope. Scarab gear. Scarab was what I used in the last game, I want to say. And did I get a weapon? Ah, uh, codename Moonlight. Is this a, considered like a Creo gear? Heavy duty orbital cutting armature, rapid and forceful spinning blade. Damn, it even has more damage than my Judgment Axe and more impact and better energy gain. But it loses out on the, the electricity. Which I honestly really like electricity on a heavy because it's going to lock them in place for just one extra boot. So I might keep this. That seems. I mean, at, at first I was like. Oh yeah, you know, I want I want electric on a spear. I can lock stuff down. But the more I play it, the more I'm like, yo, on a heavy, it's actually like unreal. Avalon Gardens. All right, this is the spot they were talking about. Um. belongs to me and you how about that body how about that your body it's my body I'll take it now. oh yeah electric is looking good especially for cutting off limbs and shit this is working out excellent So all I'm missing now is a scarab. Hey. But you even have scarab? No, you're using the heavy set from the first game, ain't ya? You do have scarab legs. Hey there, buddy. Oh, 
What's up? What are you using? You are using, uh... I need your legs. God, that combo is dirty for getting limbs off. It's liquidator. I'm getting all the sets now. Data chest. Boom, boom, boom. God, that's so sick. Okay, uh, so liquidator body, head, leg. So I need liquidator arm. Scarab is done. Um, <clears throat> let's look at some of the set bonuses here. So I know Liquidator is that Scarab attacks that slam the ground produce a traveling shockwave. Increase damage and impact of charged attacks. So Rhino Gear could be gross with the heavy. Um, Scarab. Increase defense while three or more batteries are filled. Increase defense while five or more are filled. Reduce the duration of received poison, nano, burning, and electrical. Kind of weird. Urban, so I guess the urban is like based off the scarab stuff, but I don't know because this is just defense with the three piece attack with the the six piece. Scarab seems like trash. Rhino gear seems like it might be up my alley because the whole attacks that slam produce a traveling shockwave, and that's considered a ground slam. So I mean, obvious synergy there, and then um. It's also, uh, what's it called? Damage and impact. So that's a charged attack, so I'm getting bonus twofold. So that may be worth running. Uh, yep. Okay, boys, listen, I get it. You're very, very hyper. anything from them we leg head body arm um kind of low on well no i got five and three i think i need legs I need legs there, pal. Oh, man. Mixed up my combo too much. Um, I think that's everything. Um... God damn, dude, I'm at 29 minutes. I swear, man, this game just eats time alive. I'm like, constantly like, just going and going and going and then I look at the clock and I'm like, oh my God. It's like the end of an episode already. Well, considering all the new stuff I just gained access to and this nifty shortcut back, um, I may farm up the Rhino guy because gaining access to that Rhino gear sounds pretty nifty oh man 
Electro Axe and me are going to be the best of friends. So anyway, stay tuned. Um, I may do some farming and then we're going to go into that area, um, the Babylon Gardens or whatever, in the next part. So I'll see you guys then.